Welcome to Douglas County News Exchange. I'm your host, Lena Hardy. Can you believe it? It's 2019. Happy New Year, Douglas County. But before we jump head first into the new year, let's take a step back to recap some of the holiday events that happened in December. On December 15th, volunteers joined Judge Bill McLean and the Elf Squad for Operation Christmas. Throughout the two hour period, volunteers at multiple locations passed out bags of toys to families in need. Operation Christmas served between eight to 10,000 children in the community. We thank Judge McLean for his service and generous heart. Speaking of generous hearts, actor and filmmaker Tyler Perry paid off layaway items at two Georgia Walmart stores and one of the stores just so happened to be the Douglasville location. This act of kindness grabbed the attention of Chairman Dr. Ramona Jackson Jones as she made a statement to the public by explaining how humbled she was by the generosity shown towards the shoppers in our community. Thank you, Mr. Perry. The giving spirit continued as chapter members of a local AARP decided to give back to the community by donating diapers to a pregnancy resource center called PRC Medical, located off Chapel Hill Road. We were there for the big diaper drop-off and discussed with the members on why they felt it was important to make this donation. PRC Medical has been in Douglas County for about 33 years, and we've been in this location here for about 14 years. We do free pregnancy testing, we have limited ultrasounds, uh, we also have STD testing completely free of charge. Um, also education is a big part of that STD testing as well. And then we also have our PALS program, and you're seeing a little glimpse of that in this room here. And PALS stands for Parenting and Life Skills. Because everything that you see in this store here is donated, we've purchased none of this. This has come from the kindness and the support of the community that genuinely care about women and their children and just want to help. And so they bring in new diapers, um, they bring in new clothing, gently used items that we can then provide to our moms. Because when the mothers come in and they take these classes, they earn what's called mommy money. It's not like real money, it's like a little coupon system, but it gives her access to the store where she can get everything she could possibly need for her baby and even some things for herself. Organizations like AARP that are willing to come in and donate are the backbone of our PALS program. We were told that this program existed, and so what we decided to do is to come over and take a look at what they were doing, and we discovered this lovely store. And we found out that if moms take educational classes, that they were able to get money, you know, not real money, but educational money. And then they were able to buy things that they need for their children and that touched us deeply and we asked how we could help and we were told that we could supply diapers and so that's what we decided to do you know i went before the membership they are so gracious and so generous and i said they need diapers and they responded we're a group of about 33 strong um, women and men um, what we do is we focus on the needs of people that are 50 and above. We also have a service program and under service we look out into the community in Douglas County so that would include Lithia Springs, the whole Douglas County in general and what we try to do is we try to find a need in the community and we try to service that need in some kind of way. It may not be um, through financial assistance, but it might be just through getting together with that, with that organization or whatever and providing bodies, um, trying to service them with whatever need that they have. We're looking to build our membership so that we can do more service in our community. We want to affect a change within Douglas County. You're welcome to come to our meeting. We meet the first Tuesday of every month at one o'clock at Douglasville Woody Fight Center. And um, we are open, and if you don't want to join, perhaps you can contribute to any of the three different um, service projects we currently have. We're a, we're a fun group. <laughs>
The swearing-in ceremony for the newly and re-elected officials took place on December 27th at the Douglas County Courthouse. This event was broadcasted live and recorded. Be sure to check out 23 Presents to watch the full ceremony. A new year is here, and maybe one of your New Year resolutions is to be more organized and use your time more wisely. Well, if that's the case, be sure to pick up one of our 2019 county calendars with original artwork done by Douglas County students. That's our show for this month. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to check out all of our programming on DCTV 23. You can find us on Comcast Channel 23, at and Uverse Channel 99, and online at dctv23.com. We end our show with a monthly birthday celebration for seniors at the Woody Fight Senior Center. See you next time. This is our January birthdays. We have quite a few here that are January birthdays, so we're going to be coming around. Best wishes, blessed birthdays from the Woody Fight Center and the staff. I'm Sharon Johnson. I'm the director here. The mama, you might want to call me. <laughs> that has to keep all of y'all under control, okay? Sometimes that's kind of hard. We're also glad to have Chairwoman Dr. Ramona Jackson-Jones with us, and she has a few words for you. Happy New Year. Happy birthday to our uh, January babies. You all kicked this thing off right. I see all the beautiful hats and the smiles and the excitement. On behalf of the Douglas County Board of Commissioners, we thank you and we celebrate your birthday. We will celebrate it the entire month. And we're starting off with uh, TV. I know everybody loves to be on TV because it's always so much fun to be. You can go home and watch yourself to see your mannerisms. I always find something that I liked about myself on TV or I didn't like. But, of course, it is your birthday month. I love January. Uh, you don't have any snow outside. I ordered snow, but that's okay. <laughs> but happy birthday from the Board of Commissioners, and we love our seniors here in Douglas County. Thank you. Okay, we're going to start over here, I think. So, <laughs> you're the first one up, honey. I saw this. She's like... <laughs> and your name? My name is Karen Smith. And what you want to know? Your birthday? Uh, January the 26th. Okay. okay. And where were you born? I was born in America, Georgia. That's oh. about a good three-hour drive from Douglasville. <laughs> right, right. Down in South Georgia there. Yes, mm -hmm. Happy birthday. Been here 40 years. Oh, right. Okay. Well, you're, you're, you're Douglas County. Yeah, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Diane Blanchard. Um, January 1st, and i um, from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Okay. All right. Very New well. Year's, baby. Very good. How long have you been in Douglasville? Oh, how long have you been here? Been in Georgia 30 years, 30 32 years. years. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. We're Georgia now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Bob Gruber. Birthday is on the 13th of this month. Uh, I will be 93 then. All uh, right. I was born in, uh, thank you. I was born in <laughs> western Pennsylvania, just outside of Pittsburgh. Moved here seven years ago to live with our daughter so she could take care of us. Aww. Well, it looks like she's doing a very good job, too, yeah, yeah. so, yeah. okay. Happy birthday. Gloria Gibson. Uh, my birthday is January the 13th, and I was born in Austell, Georgia. Okay, so you real close mm -hmm. to where you were. All Happy right. birthday. Thank you. So, let me get around here. Susan Ingram, January 5th. And I was born at Crawford Long in Atlanta. Okay. All right. Usually we have several of Crawford Long babies or Grady babies. <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm <laughs> Sheila McLean. I'm made in USA, Coney Island, New York. Okay. And today is my birthday. Well, happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. All right. I'm Jane Ballou. My birthday is January the 12th. I'll be 69 next week. I was born in Hampton, Virginia, and I not too recently retired from the Douglas County Library System. Very Thank good. Happy Very birthday. good. Thank you for your service. Okay. All right. 
this, this is the wild crew, y'all. <laughs> so I want y'all to realize that. This is the group I have trouble controlling. <laughs> Oh, I'm Shirley Kelly from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I'm 70, I'll be 77 on my birthday. Wow. Okay. okay. What day is your birthday? 29th of January. 29th. But oh. she's already told me today she's going to celebrate the all month. month. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh, dear. I love it. I love the hats. My name is Dale Roberts. Uh, my birthday is January the 16th. I was born in South Fulton County in the house that my parents built. And the reason that I was born at home is because my older sister was sick. She was born at Crawford Long, <laughs> but I was born at home. <laughs> Cause she, she, she tried to beat you out, huh? <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. I am Audrey Long. Uh, my birthday is the 28th. And I was born in 1940 in Elberton, Georgia, during a snowstorm. The doctor didn't make it, and the daddy and the nurse delivered me. <laughs> very, very good. That happens. That happens. Happy birthday. Hey, uh, my name is Christine Dixon, and I was born in Winston-Salem, North Carolina. Oh, wow. I came here after retirement, and I consider every day a blessing. So if the Lord lets me see January 24th, I'll be 75 years old. All, All right. right. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. My name is Peter Fabrice. Uh, I am born on January 22nd, 1946 in Amsterdam, the Netherlands. Oh. I think this is the first time we've had anybody from, from the Netherlands. Netherlands. I know. Yes. Happy yeah. birthday. Yes. Yeah, no, I don't have tulips, so, uh, and, and or wooden shoes. No, okay, okay, very good. My name is Barbara Swaim. I was born in Fort Valley, Georgia. Uh, I was, b my birthday is January the 2nd, and I turned 70. Okay. Happy birthday. Thank you. One more bag. Okay. <coughs> my name is Sam Swaim. Um, I was born in Dallas, Texas. And I'll be 78 on Elvis's birthday. All right. <laughs> All right. January 8th. January 8th. Happy good. birthday. Rhonda Henderson, and I'm from Cardinsville, Georgia. In September, I'll be here three years, and my birthday is January the 25th, and I'll be 63. All right. Very happy good. Happy birthday. And a happy birthday. My name is Susan Briscoe. I've been in Georgia since 2007, I believe. My birthday's January the 29th, and I'll be 62. All hey, right. And hey, where were you born? Oh, sorry, Kansas City, Missouri. All okay. right, Kansas City. Oh, yeah, you okay, My name is Teresa Yvonne oh. Pete, and I will say I traded one big D for another big D, and the first big D, I'm from Detroit, Michigan, but I've moved to Douglasville. Oh, <laughs> welcome. Thank you, thank welcome. you. Welcome. In fact, next, next month will be a year being a resident of Georgia. Um, I was born January 27th, and if, if, like she said, the Lord has given me three score plus 10 plus three years, so you all do the math. <laughs> I'm a math teacher, <laughs> okay. okay, and I am glad to be here. Oh, Thank you. We're glad you're here. All right. Okay. Hi, I'm Andrea Tamelli. I was born in Philadelphia, All right. Pennsylvania. I've been in Douglasville now for two years, living with my daughter. Um, and tomorrow is my birthday. All right. I will be 77. All, All right. right. Well, your name, your birth date. If you want to tell me your age, you can, but you don't have to. And where you were born. Okay. My name is Leslie Kitchens. I'm, um, I'm not 50. I'm 64 next Friday. And I was born in Cincinnati, Ohio. All right. Very happy good. Birthday. Well, happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday. I want to give a shout out to High Towers Funeral Home. They are the ones that always provide our cake and all here and come and help us celebrate. And also to Wyatt's Pharmacy. Uh, they are our good buddies. And they will be calling Bingo here in a little while. And he's got some great prizes. So, okay. One thing I need to tell you is everybody can play Bingo, but only the ones that had that bag in front of them, the birthday people, are the only ones that can win a prize. So. <laughs> Again, 
blessed birthday, okay? And we're going to sing now. Now, everybody's got to help me. So. Yes, yes. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. 